could join us today for the battle for the governor's victory bell. It's time for the coin toss now, presented by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. Minnesota is getting fired up down there as they get ready to boot this opening kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. a big hit on the quarterback. I'm going to be interested to see how he responds from this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive lineman and challenges them to start playing a little bit better. Potts awaiting the return. Fields at the 30, and he's taken down the 37-yard line. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. He's taken down around the 46-yard line. Personal foul, face mask, defense. And the defense gives up some free yards to the offense. Uh, you know, penalties can ruin a team's chances to win if they commit too many. From the 39-yard line, first down. And down he goes at the 31. Eight yards on the counter there. That makes it second and two. six-yard line. It's third down and six to go. Ball in the 36. Fires quickly, and he's got his man, and he's taken down at about the 27-yard line. This guy's got the combination of smarts and reliability that makes a receiver really dangerous. No wonder he's looked to on third down. It's the tailback. Tackled after a decent pickup. Tailback picked up seven on the draw. That will make it second and four. They're about four yards away here on second down. So the halfback gets some decent yards and a first down. I don't think there's a coach in the world who wouldn't be happy with getting five yards of carry. He might have a chance. Nice catch on that one. He's knocked out of bounds at about the five-yard line. That'll make it second and inches. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. Brought 
down around the three-yard line. So the completion goes for about two yards and a first down. And still, this gunslinger hasn't missed a receiver yet on this drive. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Looks like he flinched down there on the line. False start, offense. Little stumbles like these can kill your offensive progress. Still first down. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Quick strike to the receiver, touchdown. catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. Well, it's a big play and a big touchdown for the offense. The one thing that that play requires is time. The quarterback had time to make a decision to eventually make that long throw for the touchdown. The defense has got to do a much better job of getting pressure on the quarterback and not allowing him to sit back there and make those throws. After review of the play, the ruling on the field stands. The ruling on the field will stand. He caught it. The only thing left to say about this play is that was an excellent catch. And he hits the PAT. An eight-play, 59-yard drive. And they come away with a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. The score now. 7-0. The Golden Gophers are right where they want to be early in this one, Parker. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Gets the ball here and brought down in the backfield. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. They're giving away three yards and only making life easier for the guys on the other side of the ball. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 39. Quick throw. They'll bring him down around the 48-yard line. What impresses me so much is the guy's vision. He read the coverage perfectly to find his man for good yardage. And he's tackled at around the 44-yard line. with room to work. And they make the stop at the 22. Really a nicely thrown ball and a good job by the receiver to run right under it. Now he tries to buy some time. And he's sacked. Boy, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. That'll bring up second and 11. We've got a second and 11. Ball on the 23-yard line. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. He's scrambling, and they bring him down for a sack on the play. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry, and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. It's fourth down. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. Kicks up, and it's through the uprights. And it looks like they're ready 
for the kickoff. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 24. The Golden Gophers really got the job done on that first drive, and they took the crowd out of this thing. They sure did, and I was really impressed with the execution by the quarterback. It's tough to be able to communicate with your linemen and not to mention your wide receivers, but he did a very nice job of showing great poise, keeping his composure, and, and leading them to some points. We'll see what he can do here this next time out. Pitches back. Tackle at about the 33-yard line. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Minnesota is up four. Looks quick to his tight end, and he can't hang on. Number 88, the intended receiver on the play. That'll bring up third and inches. And he has it on the corner. He gets out to about the 44-yard line. That's good for a gain of 11 yards. First down, First down 10 yards to go. Ball on the 44. Three down, three down. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Good for a gain of six yards. That'll make it second and four. Pulls it in, and that's a first down. He's tackled at the 41. Great concentration to pull it in. From the 41-yard line, it's first down. And they get nice yardage on that run. That makes it second and six. It's complete for about seven yards and a first down. And how about the poise of this quarterback to locate his receiver, pass the sticks, and get him the ball? That was a great throw. And I think it was the quick throw by the quarterback that fouled up the defense on that one. A little toss across the middle. That's a great tackle at the 27-yard line. That makes it second and six. From the 27-yard line, second down. Minnesota holds a four-point lead. And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. This game's already shaping up to be a good one as we head to the second quarter. Minnesota's up by four. And we're ready for more football here in quarter number two. Big play there, and now they're looking at first and goal. That makes it first and goal. Here's the 11th play of the drive. hit before he can go anywhere. That brings up second and goal. It's second and goal. Ball on the two. The lineman got a little ahead of the snap count. Here's the call. Ball start. Offense. It's so tough to move the ball forward. Even a five-yard setback can do damage to a drive. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. Makes a move, and he's in for the touchdown. Strong run by the 
halfback to get into the end zone. He's a pretty sure bet to get six when you're this close to the end zone. So they had their chances to stop him, but in the end, he comes up with a big play. And he adds the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. He gets rid of this one. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. And he shoved out of bounds at about the 25-yard line. sure what the flag is about here. Let's go down to the field and find out. Offense. They'll give this one another try after the flag. And on third down, too. That's when you don't want those kind of things to happen. We've got third and 12. Ball in the 23. across the middle. Couldn't haul it in. Can't ask for much more than a three and out. Great job, defense. That makes it fourth and 12. Certainly they don't have the return on here. They get this one off and it's a beauty. They'll bring him down at the 41-yard line. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. And he's immediately tackled. That's good for a game of nine yards. That brings up second and one. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Makes it out to about the 33. He kept it himself and picked up a good-looking first down. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. First and 10. Ball on the 33-yard line. There's a fumble, and the defense picks it up. And that's exactly what this defense was looking for. Yeah, that fumble gives these guys some added life. Now let's see if they can capitalize off of it. So they're just about set to get the game going again. it to the 47. Nice pitch and catch for the first down. And down he goes at the 50. Four yards on that one. So that's just a sound play by the defense. They dropped him well short of the line of scrimmage. Right, right. 
Second down and 14. Ball on the 46-yard line. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. Out of bounds at the 47. the 45. That was a well-designed and executed pattern, but on third down and forever, it just wasn't enough. In a perfect world, he knocks this kick down inside the 10. He really got a hold of that one. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. Misfortune struck as their last drive ended in a fumble. The first rule on offense is to take care of the football. These guys need to remember that on this drive. Hands off left, and they got him behind the line. From their own 18-yard line, it's second down. Steps out at the 22-yard line. Gain of four on the play. That'll bring up third and eight. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Three, three, three. Ready. Three, three, three. Ready. 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 Washington, the return man. And he can't hang on to the ball. Tackle made at the 44. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Scrambling around. Brought down at the 38. Game of six yards. Two times, two times. Make it second and four. And he's tackled after positive yardage. They should continue to run the ball. If they keep this up, the defense will wear down very quickly. He's going to try and scramble. He's at the 20, and he's taken down right around the 18-yard line. And he has a huge gain. Yeah, I like the decision-making ability of this quarterback. He looks and looks. He sees nothing. He didn't get rattled. He sees some green in front of him, and he takes off, ends up with a great run. Nice run, and he's brought down. position to score. This is the kind of steady, strong drive that coaches love to see. Right now, they're firing on all cylinders. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Penn State's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Second down, goal to go. Ball on the one. He's on the run. Keeps it, and he's got a touchdown. There are some guys, when they get near the goal line, they just have a knack for getting the ball into the end zone. That's what we saw right there. He makes the PAT. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. 
Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Minnesota is up by four. Zips it to the back. And he hits him hard at the 43-yard line. Gain of 18 yards. First down. From their own 43-yard line. First down. They come out on an empty backfield. Slings it. He's knocked out of bounds at the 48. Just throws this one away. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. And he can't get away from the pressure. Penn State will take their final timeout. Crawford is the punter. It's away, and it's a booming punt. He's tackled at the 27. So it's time to see this offense go to work again. This defense couldn't stop them from moving the ball and inevitably finding the end zone. Throws it out there. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 27. Tackle right around the 36-yard line. There's a little bit of happy feet down there on the field. Let's get the call. Ball start. Offense. They'll line up for another third down play because of the penalty. Well, here you're in a third down situation, and then someone makes a mental mistake. It makes your blood boil if you're a coach. Third and six. Ball on the 31. They run it for the first, and he stops. Golden Gophers taking their first time out of the half. Potts is back deep to return the punt. Booming kick. He's taken down at the 36-yard line. He showed a good burst there. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Minnesota is up four. Back has it, and he dropped it. Number 24 was the intended receiver on the play. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 36. Throws complete, and he stopped immediately. Washington is back to receive. A tight first half of football, and we head to the break. The Golden Gophers lead it by four. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. 
And he's tackled at the 23-yard line. The quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play. Throws it to the outside. And he's tackled at the 45-yard line. And the big pickup through the air has made it first and ten. Minnesota holds a four-point lead. Completes it, and he's hit hard immediately. That makes it second and ten. out of bounds at about the 41. That's good for a game of four yards. That'll bring a third down, and they need to get it down to the 35. And he's going to be sacked. Boy, Brad, that was a big hit on the quarterback. It'll be interesting to see how he responds to this hit, whether or not he comes after his offensive lineman and challenges them to start playing a little bit. Trying to change the field position with this kick. Oh, excellent punt. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense, as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. He's out of bounds at about the 23-yard line. time and they bring him down for a sack on the play there's sack number four well he's being forced to make really quick decisions because he doesn't have any time to throw the ball that's going to lead to turnovers Barney to punt He's got the corner. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. It's a new possession for this offense, so what will it hold? Minnesota is up by four. Here's the give. And they got him for a loss. Second and 11 coming up now. Ball on the 42. Makes the catch and look out. He's tackling at the 32-yard line. Game of 26 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Knock him down for a loss. 
second and 12. From the 34-yard line, second down. Throws complete. He's got room to work. And he's shoved out of bounds around the 25-yard line. Pitch out, got the corner, and they make the stop at the 26. It's fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit here for this long field goal attempt. It's up, and it's wide left. No good. Every time you have a chance to finish a drive with points, you've got to capitalize. That time, they couldn't come through. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Tackle after decent pickup. Carries the ball for a nice game. He's scrambling. And down he goes at about the 47 yard line. That makes it second and two. Bring him down at about the 45. Pulls it in and stopped in his tracks with that tackle. That's a game of one on the play. That brings up second and nine. Loss of three on the play. That brings up third and twelve. We've got third and twelve. Ball on the forty-seven yard line. Got it. Complete. He's out of bounds. I'm sure the defense thought he came up short. You know, sometimes the officials' judgments can have a big impact on a game. play overall by the offense. The quarterback's doing everything he can to be able to make the play work and try to execute. The problem is the offensive line did not do a good job protecting him. They're very fortunate that ball wasn't intercepted. Now he's scrambling, and they get the sack. Call it a loss of two yards on the play. Third down. Third down again. And he's got it. And he tackles him hard at the 23. a confident quarterback but you don't want to just go back there and put blind faith into your throws you need a little bit more time to evaluate the coverage before you release the football and he throws it away they line up for another third down and they've had no problem converting their first two lets it fly couldn't haul it in. Number six was the intended receiver on the play. 
That'll make it fourth and ten. They try to get a head start there. False start, offense. Just a middle lapse, but it's going to cost them five yards. Still fourth down. Fourth and 15 after the penalty. The kick is up. It's got the distance. And he splits the uprights. Boy, he had plenty of distance there and pushed it through. Very impressive leg strength. 14-13, Minnesota. Penn State kicked this one off. From his own goal line, he's to the 20. Brought down at the 24-yard line. Minnesota's offense was rolling along earlier, and now they have gone ice cold in the third quarter. Brad, they almost look like a different team. It's like they've come out of the locker room a little bit flat here in the second half. We'll see if they can have something happen, something to spark them, and maybe get their mojo going before they end up losing this ball game. Minnesota up a point. He gets hit out of bounds at the 29. That'll be a gain of five. Here's a safe play hitting the underneath receiver, but it's a nice gain of five. Second and five coming up here. Ball of the 29. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. That's good for a gain of 10 yards. First down. Man left, man left. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Oh, a gain of seven yards. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Ready. Tackle made around the 46-yard line. Gain of eight on the play. That makes it first and ten. There's a missed tackle. That's a great tackle at the 45. From the 45-yard line, second down. Quick throw, brought down at about the 35. Gain of 10 yards. First down. That's three down and one to go. Golden Gophers lead it by one. Back to the action here. Tight ball game in the fourth quarter. Two down, two down. They'll make the sack. That makes four sacks today. Well, this speed is difficult to defend because you have to try to keep them off balance so they can't use their quickness. From the 37-yard line, it's second down. Well, as they take a look at that injury on the sideline, let's see what this backup can do at quarterback. Rose incomplete, knocked away. It's the ninth play of the drive. Minnesota with a one-point lead. Pass incomplete, trying to get it to his receiver. Fourth down, they'll line it up for a very long field goal attempt. Kicks up, and he missed it right. No good. So they come up empty-handed there. Kickers have to have a short memory. Just go out and make the next one. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. And they get nice yardage on that run. Forty-three. 
fires out to his wideout. And he's level at the 31 yard line. Tried to fool him by running the same play again. Well, fooled no one there, Brad. From the 31-yard line, it's second down. And he's taken down around the 31-yard line. the 23-yard line. It looks like they're going to try for the long field goal. It has the distance, and it's good! And with that, all the pressure now shifts back to the other side. That's what a good kicker can do. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. Not sure what the flag is about here. Let's go down to the field and find out. Receiving team. That one's going to put him way back. You just can't block a player from behind like that, or it's going to cost you. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Under pressure. Almost intercepted there. You never know what will happen when the ball ricochets like that. Good effort by the defender. They line up at the 12. Second down. Pulls it in and he's in the open field. And he's tackled right around the 22-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Decent run here, right side. That's a game of seven on the play. That'll bring up second and second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Tackle outside after a nice pickup. Call it a game of five yards. First down. Looks like someone got a head start on the line. Ball start, offense. It's so tough to move the ball forward. Even a five-yard setback can do damage to a drive. First and 15 now after the penalty. He fights forward to about the 30. Catches it, and he's immediately tackled behind the line. Third and long. This defense digs in here, and it could be their ball game. Quick strike, and he drops it. This quarterback has got to do a better job of looking off defenders and allow his covered receivers some room to improvise and get free. Washington will be the return man. It's away, and it's a booming punt. Washington fields it at the 26. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. Yeah, the defensive coordinator made it a priority to put some pressure on this quarterback. This defense has been bringing the blitz. 
and is having success getting to him. In a game like this, where one play can turn the tide, everyone has to be sharp, and the senses are heightened even more because of the rivalry trophy that's on the line. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Penn State holds just a two-point lead. He's tackled right around the 40. That reception good for around four yards. You don't have to throw it deep to have success. Any sort of completion can help boost an offense's confidence. to the halfback on the screen. And they make the stop around the 47-yard line. He scrambled. Diving for extra yardage. tackle immediately the Golden Gophers taking their first time out of the half so it's third down and they've got about two yards to go Minnesota is gonna have to use their second time out of the half Barney to punt he puts it away and it's a great kick this punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Less than two minutes in the fourth quarter. And he stops the clock with a spike. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. And he hits him hard at the 20-yard line. a quick throw well that one should do it a fourth down stop here late in the fourth quarter and that should be the nail in the coffin of this game and they're gonna have to give the ball back after going for it on fourth and long not much you can do there you gotta go for it and give yourselves a chance Here we are late in the fourth quarter in a very important and a very tight football game. And who's going to come to the forefront? We'll see who's got the most leadership. Up the middle for a nice game. Golden Gophers using their third and last timeout. From the 15-yard line, second down. Now he pitches it. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. it up the middle for a nice run. Singleton picks up about seven yards on the run. We've got second and goal. One yard to the goal line. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. He takes a knee, looking to take some time off that clock.
Old time football today. Low scoring defensive battle and it's final. 16-14, Nittany Lions. So, Kirk, how would you sum up the action of this one? Penn State comes away with bragging rights this year, and I'm sure the fans and students will enjoy it just as much as the players. They were the better team today and added another great chapter to this rivalry.